Fitzy and Whipper with Kate Ritchie. Hey, it's Lizzo. Joins Fitzy and Whipper with Kate Ritchie. Let's go! Oh my gosh, there she is. That is the magnificent Lizzo. We are so happy to be speaking to you. Hi, how are you? Why are you not talking like this is like a nature show? (laughs) There she is in her natural natural habitat. habitat. And what were you you doing just then? When when we first came on, we saw you on the screen, you were doing kind of like, is that like a massage or a lymphatic drain? It is. I have TMJ, and so this jaw locks up. I was just kind of checking on her. Yeah, right. Does that happen while you're performing sometimes, Lizzo? Does the jaw lock up? Oh, God forbid. It's never happened. Knock on wood, because, like, this bitch be (laughs) click-clacking. Do you know, Lizzo? This bitch called Louboutin, bitch. (laughs) I love that. You know, last time we met, we brought in a flute. For you to perform on, I think we're in a hotel room. It was Fitz, a recorder. We, it was we a could recorder. Only find a recorder. We've got a recorder, um, and it still sits proudly in our office with your lipstick on it. No one's allowed to touch it. It's like a shrine. We love it. Ooh, um, did I do good? Oh, yeah. you're amazing. Nice. You're okay. amazing. We were talking about natural habitat before, but your natural habitat is in Australia. I'm, I'm sorry to tell you that, but your biggest fans are here in Australia. You are coming back. Splendour in the grass. You're playing at Kudos Bank Arena here in Sydney. We are so excited. I mean, you were here in 2020. It's, it t- usually takes a few years before we get big artists back, but Lizzo, you love this country, don't you? I do. I absolutely love Australia. Um, I can't wait to be back. Like, I had so much fun last time. It's going to be even better this time, baby. Yeah. She's playing arenas, honey. I did play the Opera House last time, though, and that was like a dream come true. So yeah, yeah. let's see what new dreams I can make come true in Australia. Yeah, I did ask my daughter this morning, quickly before I left the house, I was saying, we're going to have Lizzo on the phone. Do you have any questions for her? She's eight and a half, by the way. She had two questions. She said first one was a joke. Um, can she get some free tickets? Okay. And the second <laughs> one was um would you move <laughs> would you move to australia would i move i mean to i guess australia. you can't you can't spend extended time but how long have you been here and what else would you like to do i can't go there's a lot of sharks so we can't really go to the beach like that right? <laughs> like, <laughs> like where are we going to hang out I don't know. I think I would spend a little bit of time in Australia. Like, I like that part of the world, Mm -hmm. you know, to, like, hop over to New Zealand and go to Asia. Like, I've never been there before. So, definitely, I I would spend some time in Australia. Well, you know, kick it on the other side of the hemisphere. Love it. it. Love it. How it On the other side of the hemisphere where the hems work. You know what I'm saying? We can organise that for you. How many do you want? All three of them? No, it was a joke. It was a joke. I love that. I loved it. (laughs) Congratulations on Record of the Year at the Grammys for about damn time. That is a huge achievement for you. And you're sitting at a table with Beyonce, like one of your idols. You had Adele there as as well must have been a very surreal night for you Lizzo yeah it was I you know but I, I really took it in like I was very present and like just had a ball I think that's all you can do because I was like this is the most goaded year to be nominated for a mm, Grammy yeah. I'm probably not going to win anything so let me just sit and enjoy the relationships and the time yeah. <laughs> that I have and get drunk. And I did. When you sit down with Adele, I know that you have expressed that you would love to do a collaboration with her oh, and maybe God. get the flute mm. out. Do you, when you sit to, next to Adele, do you press that issue a little bit more? Have you had more of a conversation since? No, I don't. That's, we don't talk about collabs. I think it's just like, there's so much more fun things to be talking about than mm. work. <laughs> Exactly. I mean, it must. Adele like to talk shit. You okay? It'd be fun. Like she, we sit with our little tea and we just sit. <laughs> oh, I love that. Can you tell us? Because you know we've been a bit spoilt here uh, in Sydney and Australia. We've had Ed Sheeran. Harry Styles was here not long ago. Can you give anything away about what your show will look like? Your arena spectacular. It's going to be amazing because I've been doing the special show for like half a year now, yeah, yeah. I'm going to make it even better. So yeah. like, I'm just bringing all the big girls, all the diamonds and glitter, wow. um, all the music and all the tears, the laughter, 
the rum shaking, yeah. like the rum rump. Which I'll say rum. Did you, I think rump. you said rum. Yeah, because <laughs> Bacardi's all round. Yeah, your show is so energetic. It's gonna be- you're going to laugh, you're going to cry, you're going to dance, you're going to repeat. <laughs> when you're talking about the diamonds and the costumes, how many... Co- well, ha- firstly, do you know how many people in the entourage and how many costumes do you have? Like, oh, yeah. how many suitcases are you packing to travel for all those changes? Because they're pretty incredible. My, my personal suitcases shocked me this time. How many? I mean, excuse me if I sound privileged, but I'm not really packing or loading up anything. So I don't even see my luggage really anymore, thank God. But um, when I got home, they were taking my luggage out of the car. And when I say it looked like a Ramoa store, <laughs> it, it was an Amazon Prime wish list <laughs> in my <laughs> garage. Like the suitcases went from the front of my garage all the way out the door. Amazing. And I was like, there's no way, this has got to be for the Queen of Sheba. But turns out <laughs> I am the Queen of Sheba. Wow. <laughs> and do you, do you come home with more suitcases, though? Because I know when you're on the road, obviously, you travel with a lot you are very busy do you shop like do you kind of are you taking home a lot i do shop and you know what another thing i get a lot of gifts my i the venues give me like big gifts like i'll get a giant hockey stick and i'm like okay i gotta like (laughs) i gotta pack this up so yeah i do come back more and where is all that where is all that where do you where is it oh excuse me where is it (laughs) Yeah, no, wait, like, where do you keep it? Like, I know I might get the odd show bag into the office and I palm it off to the family. Like, where does all that stuff go? I have, like, a storage, I guess. Yeah. yeah. And then I like to give a lot of things away. I give a lot away. Man. Yeah, you got to. You oh, have to, wouldn't you? We're pumped. It's going yeah. to be a massive 2023 yeah. for you as well. You're headlining Glastonbury as well, which is massive. I mean... I don't know if you can give anything, but I, I saw you with Harry. You came out as a special guest with Harry at Coachella. Special guest. I know that... Is it true that Missy Elliott just performed with you up on stage in Europe somewhere as well, Lizzo? Yes, yeah, it was in Los Angeles. Missy hopped on stage. Wow. Yeah. Um, gosh, you just reminded me that maybe I should get some special guests. <laughs> the boys are free. Yeah, we'll, we'll help they you out. They can bring the flute. We'll, we'll do we, it. We are so excited to have you back down under. Um, you are coming on 23rd of July. You're performing at Sydney's Kudos Bank Arena. You're also at Splendour in the Grass. But you can go and get tickets next Tuesday. Go to livenation.com.au to register. That will sell out very quickly. You are a superstar, Lizzo. Thank you very much for your time. Aw, thanks, guys. Thanks, Lizzo. See you then. See See you in July. Fitzy and Whipper with Kate Ritchie. Nova.